They gave me a great faith. They gave me strong values. They gave me the value of hard work. I can't tell you how much I saw my parents work their fingers to the bone to get us into a position. But they didn't say you're guaranteed anything, son. They said, you better get out there and compete. We're going to give you every opportunity in Alabama public schools, and you, you, it's on, you're on your own because you live in America, the greatest country in the world, and the greatest state right here. So I promise to you that I will work very hard in this office. I know we're going to get some questions. We have many differences that I think we could talk about, uh, and I'll, look, I'll reserve those for the questions. I don't want to exceed my time. I don't know if you're keeping it or not, but good. All right, so uh, again, please go to the website. I appreciate the Attorney General being here. I think this is an important debate. And let me say this. I agree with this comment about politics being uh, sometimes a messy business. I had to run against Jim Folsom Jr. Nobody wants to ever have to do that. <laughs> and I'm mindful of Ronald Reagan's 11th command. I absolutely respect that. You won't hear me say anything personally about my opponent. But let me remind you that Ronald Reagan who gave us that great 11th commandment, ran in a Republican primary against an incumbent president named Gerald Ford. And he ran on policy and principles. And that's what this race is going to boil down to. So I urge you to continue to do your good work, support these great candidates who are here. Please learn about where the candidates stand on the issues and what their record is. And uh, make your decision and get out to vote on June 1st. Thank you all so much for having me today. Thank you. <laughs>